The treasurer's office in Virginia Beach is the city's tax collection agency. When you buy a city decal or pay your water bill, the bucks come here. The issue is over how this office is managed. Councilman Bob Jones believes money is being wasted. On a per capita basis, the expense of running our city government is 88 percent of the average for the state. And the per capita expense of running our treasurer's office is 147 percent. I don't know what the explanation is for that, that disparity. Treasurer John Atkinson says Jones is wrong. My office does three times more work than the treasurer's office of Norfolk for a considerably less cost per transaction. But City Council, agreeing with Jones, voted Monday to cut $74,000 from Atkinson's budget. The treasurer says Jones misled them, and politics was his motive. Uh, Councilman Jones is trying to run to the Senate based on what he can do at City Hall. Well, if his example of what he can do in the Senate is what he's doing in this office, I, I invite him to go out and tell the public what it's all about. He doesn't have a leg to stand on. It, the fact I'm running for the state senate is, happens to be incidental to this uh, particular concern. Um, but uh, you know, who's going to believe that? At stake in this whole budget dispute, says Atkinson, is the future of the four satellite treasurer's offices, including the one here in Kempsville. If the $74,000 aren't restored, warns Atkinson, these offices go. Citizens are already signing petitions to prevent that, but the final decision will be up to City Council when it takes a final vote on the city budget Thursday. In Virginia Beach, Joel Rubin, The Daily News.